there is one chart that the OBR has has uh, published in its book, which comes up with a very stark conclusion. They just say they expect real household disposable income, which is basically the sort of best way of how we measure how people feel, feel mm. about whether or not they can well, afford their lifestyle, yeah. whether they've got any money left at the end of the month. Um, but they expect it to fall this year at the fastest rate since comparable records began in the 1950s. Yeah. Just I mean, this think is the biggest about fault. that yeah. for a moment. Whatever the specifics, mm. whatever the fine details of all of the proposals, and of course it's really important to look at the nuance and the different details in black and white, the overall picture for the public, for the politicians, is going to be one that's very, very testing in the next year, in the next couple of years into the run into this next Well, and if people don't cycle. feel better by the time of the next general election, I mean, this could still cost the Conservatives dear. Yep.